I just wanna zen the body so good spreads possess the body. I don't really fuck with everybody. I'm just tryna be a somebody. Diggory, diggory, die. Can't be honest, secure a spot. Is a war I really wanna pop? Questions that are floating in my thoughts. But I really never doubt myself. Cause I know I'm a witness self. Cause I'm tryna impress myself. I'm not doing it for no one else. Fiona may be a beginner, but she's a winner. And she's gonna win this out. Overwrite right, is bringing the heat. She's hot like a heater. She's gonna burn it up. Fifty is spitting. You can see a spitter. I guess you can call her a coat. Burn up. Hickory, tickory, die. Can write my legs. I'm bound to apply this man. Be high, but best believe I'm never ever ever gonna stop. Yeah, Fiona Abrara from the Kibanza, that's the black girl, Jimmy B. Dumelam San Bonani, you are watching War Talent Review on Mohalo Online TV with your boy TJ Mulefe. Nothing but the best. Awesome performance from Fiona Aurora Buffet too. Nice one, nice one. I love it. I love it. I also want to be a, a musician Buffet too. But without wasting any of your time Buffet too, let's take it to an ad break and when we come back, we will be having a conversation with one of our guests. Welcome back everyone, you're still watching Raw Talent Review on Mohalo Online TV with your boy Debo Homolife. I'm here Bafetu with Togozani Denisa who is an author Bafetu. He'll be telling us more about who is uh, Togozani Denisa, what is he aiming for? Yeah, 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 yeah. Like, I would like to know who is Togozani, like, why is Togozani doing Okay, Tosan Denisa is an author, a writer, a founder of three movements that we are doing as collaborative artists from South Africa, even all over the globe. I'm a father, a husband, a quote writer. We have written over 10,000 quotes professionally so far. I'm running my own blogs, etc. Et mm, 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 mm. so, 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 what inspired Tosan to be an author? What drived you to be an author? Okay, the reason I became an author is to realize that as people we are living our lives, sometimes you don't know what you are born for. And also, I've discovered that I used to play soccer and I discovered that I have love to, of writing more than soccer. Oh, you used to play soccer as well? I used to play soccer <laughs> big day. But yeah, I discovered yeah. as time goes on, I have love for writing more than to play soccer. So I chose the route of writing. I can say, per se, this is one of my other calling. In this chain of life, yeah, yeah. So, 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 we are busy about the boring. Yeah, yeah. Yes. No, so nice. Um, then, what is the book all about? What is we are in a race? Okay. What is it talking about? This book it speaks about types of race which are running as human beings. Mm -hmm. In this book, you'll discover there are five major races which all of us who are running as human beings. Number one, the race of by a, a sperm is to fertilize the egg. That's the first race yeah, which we yeah. are running as human beings. So yes, yes. You and I have overcome that race. Yeah, we are born. Yeah, we are born. So there is a second race now which we are running as a human being. Mm. A race now where you have to pass a patent to the next, genera next generation. Mm. After mm. that, many people are without a patent in their hands. Yeah, yeah, right. true. Also, a race to obtain something which you want to buy in this world. For instance, if you want to buy a house, you are running a race to obtain material resources. Yeah, yeah, that's the yeah. race which is so, so important. A race to gain eternal rewards. Mm, mm. So, according to scripture, you see some, there are some scriptures there which are coming from the Bible. Yeah, 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 yeah. Is that even after life, there is, there is what you call life after death. death yeah. So, you're going to receive an eternal crown which is eternal. Mm. So, mm. most people they only focus on running a race for temporary things, forgetting about eternal things. Yeah. So, yeah, that's why yeah, those yeah. I've mentioned in the book that they are known as five major races. And also, you've got what you call 60 types of races that are running human beings. I'm glad I have you in the studio. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, yeah. There's a presenter race whereby you are running a race as a presenter. There is also someone who's running a race as, as a script writer. Right, yeah, yeah. And there's yeah, also someone yeah. running a race also as a football. A football. So you know that each of them has their own race. race yeah. So I think that many people they don't know what race they are running. That's why it's so easy for us to fight one another. Because you don't know which race you ought to run. But when you know your own race, 
you run at your own pace without committing the next person. Mm. So that's what also we call a race for husband, a race for wives, a race for children, a race for teachers. You're going to find it inside the book. Wow. So this book has six types of race. I'm not saying these are the only race we have in this book. Yeah, yeah, I know yeah, for plain, plenty of races. Yeah. Yeah. Six so that I can try to inspire someone to elaborate something that is a race that is a running. Also a race for a mentor. Mm. In this book, we'll find that there's a close mentor and also a father with a mentor. Mm. A close mentor is someone whom you know by name, who's close to you, whom you can call at any time. Yeah. Who's yeah. monitoring you, you know, all that. Yeah. So in the race, that's one of the race that person is running. A father with a mentor is someone who's far away from you. Like, for instance, I'm mentoring someone through a book. So when you have my book of I become your own mentor while I'm far away from you. So also a following mentor inspires someone by tapes and music. So they use yeah, many yeah. different parts to inspire someone. But someone, yeah. a problem with a following mentor, they don't know who's, 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 who's under them when it comes to mentorship. But it tells me he knows I have this five, 50 people whom I'm mentoring. I don't know. I don't know what you said. Wow, wow. Now, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Now, the, the thing is the, 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 the interesting part of how you're telling me the you know, content of, of this book. Yeah. But um, I would also love uh, and, and, and try to understand with you, like, uh, from, from writing this book, what was the inspiration uh, behind in writing the book? The inspiration behind the book I was preaching in my day in the church. Yeah. So I was preaching about types of race. I discovered that in each and every single race there are rules. Mm. So now I begin to realize that so many people they are living their lives without knowing their race. Yeah. So I came from that point doing that inspiration that let me write a book to want someone that say and tell that there's a race that they are, they are yeah. running. Yeah. So they must be aware that yes, they are living their own life, even if they break hearts. It was there in the book we find that there's a race for people who break hearts, mm. people who hate others. So they must know that every single individual is running a race. So what inspired me the most was to tell someone that, hey, there is a very yeah, yeah. be away. <laughs> wow, beautiful conversation that I'm having with your brother, Tokozan and Denisa Bafetu. And let's take a break, Bafetu, just with this opus of minds. And when we come back, we will be getting more from him and the book as well, Bafetu. For now, let's go to an air break. Alright, welcome back, Babu. He is still watching War Talent Review on Mohalo Online TV. Still with your boy TJ Mulefe, right here with Tokozani Ndinisa, Ushela Rabanzi Bafetu, with his book, We Are in a Race. Let's get to know more, 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 more about this book. Brother Ndinisa, uh, uh, yeah, we want to also know how, how can we get hold of this book. My book is available online via mm -hmm. Amazon. You can go and get it there. Also, you can contact me on my Facebook pages. Yeah. You can deliver the book via courier. You can find the book. Yeah. yeah. So, um, I, I would like to also know, and the audience would like to know, which is, is it the book launched already, or are you planning to launch it? Okay, yeah. I'm available to do any relaunch with anyone at any time. Uh -huh. Even though I've done it before, because I've discovered how we, how we do things, we do things differently. Mm -hmm. So I'm willing to learn something new mm -hmm. and to give an opportunity to a certain audience so that they can learn more about the book. Yeah, yes, yeah. So how, how, how could uh, the audience as well get to uh, uh, know you better or get to hold you, like your socials, uh, to okay. interact with you? Okay, you can find me on Facebook, from Zandinisa, the author and writer. Go to Facebook again, find me under this Facebook page, Movement of Writers, ebook Writers, also South African Voice Writers. You can find me there, ebook on Instagram. You can find me also, Instagram, search for Tanzanian engineers and you can find me there, I'm available. And you can even go on Amazon yeah. and get other books which I've written, because this is not the only book mm. which I've written as an author. I've got plenty of books, you find the wow. different inspiration. Wow. Kind of books. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's it from us, Buffet Two Years in Zuida Nani Ru, Brother Tobazani Wuti. You can where can you find the book actually and read it for yourself? Like I would also uh, 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 love Wuti to motivate some young other upcoming authors out there Wuti. What can they do in order to, to see their work beautiful as like yours, my king Wuti? Like how what are the measures that we should take? Okay, number one, I'll first quote my own quote. 
it says it's either you build your life by yourself or you destroy by yourself no one to play. Mm-hmm. What I'm trying to say, as an individual, go and search for opportunities. Yeah. Don't only wait for opportunities to come to you. Yeah. Well, some op- certain people, they need you to go and knock. And then number two, make sure that you search for information. Like for instance, when I had to write this book, I had no mentor. Mm-hmm. And it's so shocking, I managed to write the book and finish without having a mentor. Yeah. So I went to an extra mile up, I ended up searching for information how to write a book. And I discovered how to write a book. Mm-hmm. Also, find your own style of writing. Because I discovered that as a writer, we've got different style of writing. Of writing yeah. Like my own style here is totally different from any other writer outside there. So you must know your own style is right. And number to be willing to be criticized by people, even if they can say whatever thing. It's so cool sometimes to receive criticism. But yeah, yeah. Away, in your own manner, you must learn something from that criticism. So make sure as you are writing, save your work somewhere else. Because yeah. most writers they will write books, but they don't save their own content. Like for instance, I read this book I've written a using cell phone. Mm. I didn't use a computer. Mm. Mm. Because I realized sometimes you lose a computer, sometimes when it crashed, crash, they're yeah. in trouble. But when you have some certain clouds apps, you know that they are saving your own work. Even if they stole your own phone, you, you know that you're going to go to your own cloud and retrieve your own work so they can write your own book. And at the end of the day, don't give up. Even if you are unknown, don't only wait for your computer time frame so you can start your own work. Start now, wherever you are. It's either you build your life or you just it by yourself. Ah, it's really my favorite. It's either you build your life or you destroy it by yourself. But for me, number five, to no brother Tomozani, we are done. Let's take it straight to Fiona Aurora with how to make it big snake. Thank you, Debza. Well, I'm standing right here with Mr. Favorite, who is going to tell us more about himself and make us a quick snack. Good morning, good morning. Good morning, Jesus. Good morning. 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 Good Oh, Mr. Favorite, Mubai, and you figure out Mr. Favorite. Yes, yes, Mr. Favorite uh, actually is, is my stage name. Mm-hmm. Uh, it's not my 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 political name. Okay. My political name is Funom uh, Dao. I'm from uh, Limpopo, Venda. All right. Uh, Mr. Favorite is just uh, to be here. Oh. It's a favor of God. Oh. So everywhere I go. I got some some favor. Oh, you are highly yeah, favored. Yeah, I'm highly favored. All right. Yes. So um, you are also an artist. Yes. So how's Kalele Gamanzi about that? Tell us more about it. How did you get to be an artist, and what made you? And what did you just wake up one day and thought, but you know what? I actually want to try this gospel thing, or was it something that you've always wanted to do? No, uh, the uh, I cannot say I'm an artist. Uh huh. Uh, but I have a gift. Oh. Because an artist uh, is, is something else. Okay. Uh, I, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a worshiper. I'm a, I'm a God, uh, God-chosen person, mm-hmm. which is I, I, I praise God and then I, I sing. So because there's a category, people, they have to know you in this world. <laughs> you need to say, I'm an artist, so you can be in that platform. Mm-hmm. But I'm just a worshiper of God. Uh, it started uh, uh, at a younger age. Uh, I, I'm a... I, I, I'm born in, 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 the, in, the, in the church place. You understand? My, my, my grandmother, she was, she, she was a pastor. Oh, you understand? Okay. So I grew up singing there. When the older people ran away, they didn't come to, to church on Sunday. Uh-huh. I have to go there. Yes, with that platform. Young person mm-hmm. uh, with the mic in front of people started singing. That's where it started. And that's where it started. And from there, how has it been going? Have you been getting gigs? And how has it been going for you? No, everything is is, is 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 so well, my sister, and then my songs is on the platform. I'm getting oh. gigs, I'm getting the event to go and perform. Like like today, I'm coming to the to the TV and yes. then just to show my talent. So everything has been highly favored. All right, well, as you are, Mr. Favors, it should be. So tell us, have you ever had a worst experience where you had to go perform and something totally bad happened? Yes, yes, my sister. You see, like an avocado without just some uh, salt, mm-hmm. yeah, and then you will get some disappointment along the way. You know, other 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 event, you find out that uh, you, you 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 are you are about to sing, and then they, they switch off the 
the, the, the lights, oh, they switch okay. off the mic and everything. Okay. And then other event, you said you are going there and then uh, you find out that no, you don't have a, a, a money to go to that place oh, and everything. So okay. that's the kind of challenges that we face. Okay, so um, out of all the events that you have currently done so far, with more to come hopefully, which one has been the best of your career right now? Uh, there is an event that I, I was sharing the stage with uh, about you know, mm -hmm. the Lombard uh, machine. That was uh, the, 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 the best event that I, I was. And then the other one in some uh, in local uh, uh, awards, uh, uh, how awards, how thing awards. Mm -hmm. uh, then it was a big, a big stage, big artist. So it was so good. Yes. Okay. I'm sure. Okay. So. For people to find you, where can they find you? Um, are you available for bookings? What? How do we find you? And where do we find you? Okay, first of all, if they really did want to to find me, they need to 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 follow a uh, uh, Mukale TV. Mm -hmm. They will find right. me there, obviously. Mm -hmm. And then on my number, zero eight four six zero seven zero six nine four, Facebook, Mr. Favored, Instagram, same thing, Twitter, same thing. Okay. Well, um. Before we indulge, tell, um, can you please tell me for anyone who is in your shoes or who would like to walk the path that you have walked, what would you say to them? How would you motivate them? Words of inspiration? Because I know I do understand that there are some hardships yes. and you, there are things that you have faced. So tell them how you navigated around it and how to avoid it. Okay. First thing, people has to be themselves. Uh, there's a lot of Lundi, there's a lot of Rebecca's, mm -hmm. so they have to be themselves. Right. First of thing, you have to be unique because there's a lot of artists out there. They need to see something new, something beautiful. So you need to be you and then you need to wait for your time. Don't just sing because other people are singing, Do but wait for your time. Yes. And when it's your time, there's no one gonna stop you for your time. And then be patient on your work and then do an original work. We, we are tired of repeating the same songs that other people have yes. done. So write a new song. If you don't know how to write, there's a people like me, I can write for the people. Oh, it's play. also a songwriter. You, you see, yes. So just write a new stuff and the people can, can uh, enjoy the, the, the new stuff without you are singing. Alright, so are you done so we can indulge? Or? Yes, yes, I'm done, my sister. Okay, so are you just going to put it on the red? Let me help yes. you out there with a bit. Okay. Are you just going to spread it there? Yes, yeah. all you have to do is just to, to spread it. Okay. So he's mixed it with some flavor? Yes. Okay. Yes. Not too much. Not too much, Not just too enough. Much here, just enough. enough. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so that one is for you. Yes. And then let's just spread it right here. Just a little bit, it's not, yeah. not too much, not too, much. Not too little, just yes. enough. <laughs> yes. Alright. Okay, let's, let's take a bite then. Why not? Shall we? Yes. Mm. Mm. <laughs> mm. Did you hear that? Did you hear that? Well, the flavor. Yes, you did, flavor. yes, you did say it was healthy. I can taste it. Mm. Mm. Well, as I continue to enjoy my snack, let us head to the gig guide. presents Tembisa Guaido Festival at the Mikarin Stadium on the 1st of October 2022. Tickets are available at Copy Tickets as well as Shop Rides. Nimash presents Face of Nimash Africa on the 15th of October at Johannesburg TBC. Tickets are all right, ladies and gentlemen, we have came to the end of our show. Nice, beautiful. We are going to give you a nice performance from our presenter here, yes. Rona, Rona. <laughs> but nevertheless, guys, please follow us on Facebook uh, at Mohala Online TV on the website www.mohalaonlinetv.co.z.
said, hey. But for me, my friend, you and my co-host, Fiona, yeah. Rora, we say ciao. I'll we'll see you next week. <laughs> Let's get it. My name is Anadi, this shit is so hard for me All of these people ain't cheating me properly Playing my heart like it's a game monopoly You the crime, man, you the night Time for stories, oh nigga, I ain't buying shit Cheating on me and you thought I was fine with it I'll never ever be a oh, with it Why is you niggas unfaithful? Why is you niggas ungrateful? Why is you niggas so playful? Play with our heart, piss with all of them darts Need a chick to fall apart, need a chick to fall apart Huh, huh, why is you niggas unfaithful? Why is you niggas ungrateful? Why is you niggas so playful? Play with our heart, you piss with all of them darts Leave the chick to fall apart Leave the cheeks to fall apart All you other bitches drive you crazy When it comes to me, boy, you lazy I don't really know what made you hate me Yes, you're serving and you're changing lately God, give me another man One little kiss me every time he can One little walk around, walk around, walk around Holding my hand, don't feel ashamed That's why I need me a man Who's gonna make me understand what love is